Hello and a very warm welcome. Young boys will take on Manchester United. The Swiss based outfits host Manchester United and back in the Champions League. And hopefully we can go far in this competition and really get back in this competition as a solid Champions League team. Being tossing it up in the Europa League for far too long. We take on Young Boys. Tuesday. An early kickoff as well, quarter to six, as we take on the Swiss based outfit. Uh, young boys lie third in their division. They played five, won two, drawn two, lost one. Manchester United come into this game after an impressive 4 1 victory over Newcastle United. Now, people say Manchester United got an easy group. Young boys, yes, we should beat these twice, uh, they'll probably finish bottom of the group. Atlanta, very good outfit in Serie A. And Villarreal, well, we all know what happened in the Europa League final, so I wouldn't be underestimating Villarreal. Now, going to be interesting, because now the season ramps up, we've got games coming thick and fast. Young boys on Tuesday, West Ham, West Ham in the cup. Then you've got Villa. And then we've got the dreaded October, where we play all the top teams. Um, so yeah, now the season starts to ramp up, and rotation will be key. Now are we going to see some fringe players come in? The likes of Waimata, Van Den Beek, Lingard, uh, Marshall, players who are not in like the Premier League squad. Um, yeah, Marshall, Cavani. Is he going to be back? Interesting. This is where Solskjaer needs to use his squad because theoretically, young boys, this should be a very comfortable win. We need to start the Champions League campaign very well. Um, yeah. I won't be able to watch this game, which is very good in, as I do start my new job on Monday, which will obviously go into Tuesday. So I will miss this game. As soon as my shift finishes, I'll be watching the highlights on my phone as I wait to get a lift home. Because, yeah, I need to get a lift home. But yeah, um, so I'll probably do a reaction on Wednesday morning after I've watched the goals. Uh, yeah, good in, but you got to work, can not you? This is on BT Sport, 5.45 kickoff. Yeah, and it's it's um, a feel good atmosphere at the club. The club's got a lot of energy, positive vibes. But Manchester United, we've been in the Europa League too long. It's time to go on a big Champions League run, in my opinion. Of course, Premier League is bread and butter. That's our main focus. But yeah, let's go for a run in the Champions League. We're going to get out the group. I mean, if we don't get out of the group, that's a disgrace. And then we see who we get in the knockout stages. But yeah, got to go with the same attitude. Yes, we should be winning this game, but we can't get complacent. Young boys, um, yeah, everyone expects us to wipe the floor with this uh, team. But yeah, you can't take... I mean, they beat uh, F FC Zurich 4-0 at the weekend, uh, FC Young Boys, and FC Zurich are actually top of the Swiss League, so to beat top of the league 4-0 is a very good result for Young Boys. So, yeah. I, I've got to say, I don't know too much about them. I do know that um, Jankovic, the guy who got sent off for Southampton, after like 20 seconds he plays for them but yeah i don't know too much about them um i'm looking forward to the game i think solskjaer has to rotate his squad be interesting to see if dean henderson comes back into playing goal um yeah possibility is there to rotate um the likes of why matter donny van den beek uh Fred, is he going to be available after the Brazilian, like, it was quite strange that, like, the Brazilian thing where they had to 
they, they weren't allowed to play, etc. There's chance for a rotation here for Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. And to be honest, it's time to use the squad. You can't. Is Ronaldo going to feature? See, these are. It's all on Solskjaer, really. Just looking at the bench against Newcastle. So let's have a look at the bench. So we've got Eric Bailly, Lindelof. These are players that could come in. Diego Delo. Uh, Fred, he was on the bench actually. Um, very strange about that. Um, Tom Heaton on the bench, Van den Beek, Marshall, Matter. So these are players Solskjaer could use. Now, Ronaldo, uh, 36 years of age, can he be playing Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Wednesday, Sunday, Wednesday, Sunday? We wait and find out. I'm looking forward to the game. I think this should be a comfortable evening for Manchester United as Manchester United back in the Champions League. A club like Manchester United should be in the Champions League every year and we should be competing for this trophy. I'm going 2-0 Manchester United. Yeah. Three points is a must. Let's get the Champions League campaign up and running with a positive victory. Comment down below your score predictions. And I'll do a match reaction on Wednesday morning. Adios.